Broadcom is back on the rise, jumping more than 30% in the past three weeks and coming within just $4 of its record high in June. Is this a sign of renewed success for tech? Thanks for joining us here on Market Beat Media today. I'm Bridget Bennett. We are diving into what's behind the recent momentum in Broadcom stock. The company is the leading player in the semiconductor and technology space, providing essential components for things like data centers, networking, broadband, and wireless communications. Now, their products power everything from your smartphone to high-speed internet connections and are in high demand as the world becomes, of course, more connected and reliant on technology. Now, despite some ups and downs, especially over the summer, Broadcom has maintained steady growth, and it's sticking to the stock's two-year uptrend, too. Now, that is especially impressive when you take a look at competitors like AMD and Micron, who are both struggling to gain momentum after the summer's volatility. Broadcom did have some lower-than-expected guidance in their last earnings report. The company is still projecting $14 billion in revenue, though, for Q4. And that is impressive, especially when you consider the challenges in the semiconductor industry. Now, they also posted a huge 47% year-over-year revenue growth in Q3, which caught a lot of attention and helped to fuel this recent rally. Now, the good news for Broadcom, analysts are still bullish, even with that slightly lower guidance. They have reiterated buy ratings with price targets reaching anywhere from $205 to as high as $240, which suggests there could be a lot more upside from where the stock sits today. Technically, Broadcom's chart is looking strong. There's a consistent pattern of higher lows, which means investors are stepping in to buy on dips. And with key indicators still showing bullish signals, there's reason to believe the stock could keep climbing. With the recent surge in the S&P 500, it is likely Broadcom won't be far behind in testing its all-time highs again. So if you are looking for exposure to the tech and semiconductor space, this could be a company to watch. Let us know your thoughts. Are you ready to ride Broadcom's momentum or are you waiting to see if this stock might dip again? I'd love to hear your feedback. Comment below. Join our conversation here on Market Beat Media. Thanks for tuning into our channel today. Don't forget to subscribe to stay tuned for more market news on companies just like this. As always, happy investing, everyone.